Hey there, fuel operations team. This back here, this is a tough business to manage. And it seems like the biggest challenges we face these days is in keeping a full staff at your stores. And when you're short staffed, you've got to prioritize what you do and don't get done each day. You might even have to cut out certain activities. Well, the cleaning of the forecourt, that can't be cut out. But you can save some time if you approach it in a strategic way. I'm going to show you today how to clean your forecourt quickly. Check this out. Cleaning strategically means focusing time in your schedule on specific areas at certain times and not trying to tackle your entire station every day. Here's what your day will look like. Pick just one lane to deep clean. After that, do a quick wipe down of all customer touch points. Design your schedule so that each lane receives a deep cleaning once per week. When doing the deep clean, make sure all of the surfaces that your customers walk on, touch, or see while they are filling up are cleaned using the right chemicals. This includes concrete stains and dirt and grime found on nozzles and cradles, fuel dispenser skirts, payment areas, and hoses. To remove dirt and grime from your fuel dispenser, nozzles, and cradles, use Otis. Three scoops if diesel and grime is heavy, just one scoop if the buildup is light. Otis wipes, if you have them, work great for this as well. For best results, after using Otis, rinse the area with water to remove any excess residue. Finish your fuel dispenser deep cleaning by polishing the surface and protecting it from UV damage with Protero or Luxus wipes. This step is critical for keeping the dispensers clean for the rest of the week. Apply eczema to your concrete stains using one cup of eczema per gallon of water in your two gallon sprayer. If applying with a broom, apply just one quarter cup per fueling area. If you have diesel, don't forget to treat the fuel islands. Okay, deep clean is done for one lane. That took me about six minutes. It might be a little longer depending on how dirty your fuel station is. Time to move on to phase two, wiping down the touch points. For this, all you will need is one scoop solution of Otis and a rag. In all other lanes, you are just going to wipe down the areas a customer will touch. This includes fuel nozzles, buttons, touch pads, and the tops of the dispensers. This ensures that dirt or residue is removed daily from these key areas so your customers always have a great experience. Don't forget to wear your PPE and make sure to cone off the lane or pump that you are working on. All right, that was the quick clean, wiping down all customer touch points at all fuel dispensers. Took me about four minutes. By approaching cleaning in a strategic way, you can make sure that your customers have a wonderful experience at the pump every single time.